Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And it's time to sprunk up. Well, one one last car, really. We're going to sprunk this puppy up. But it might not stay 100% sprunky at the end of all this. This is, we're just going to see. I bought myself a Quail Brawler. It was on sale. And it's, you know, once upon a time it was kind of relevant because it had a really good top speed for off-roaders. But I think it's I think it's been eclipsed by more modern stuff. Bull bar and lights, bull bar with winch and lights. It's this is it's an interesting league because the stock remember you want to keep it as a clean aerodynamic kind of car where you where you see that a lot of times some of the stuff online that makes sense. But if you want to do more of a uh, more of a rally, you know, cross country, you know, Baja 1000 kind of thing. You'd think you'd put these on. The beefiness. I, I think I'm thinking just now. I'm not going to do that. I think I'm going to do a more, a more egalitarian. This is just. It's it's the maybe we'll make it like an SUV that never goes off road. That kind of thing. I don't know. We, there's different options here. We have options. Bumper bar. Nah, no. Nah, I want clean. I'm in a clean mode, as a way. You'll see that I have another video that I just did that's going to go up after this because reasons. And I should probably put a roll cage in it, but it does look so clean that way. Let's see. Horn, don't really care. Lights, headlights. Yeah, we'll throw xenons on it. Neon kits, neon layout, front, back, sides. Neon color, crew. Which will be interesting to see if it stays crew, because we're going to be going back to base pretty soon. Not going to be sprunk forever. I mean, I'm sprunk forever, but I mean, it's like, you know. Primary color. Crew, baby. Look at the glowing green. Do it. Now, secondary. What is the secondary? Oh, here we go. Give you a crew purple kind of thing. If we're truly sprunking it up, then it's going to be ice white. See the contrast between the lime green. It doesn't work together. They don't work well together. I mean, black does work for it. The black... That's more sprunky. That's more limonade. But let's just back out from that. The black... Does work. Any metallic, any carbon black? More of a carbon look to it. We could do that. Crew emblem. Normally, I say let's sprunk it up for the sake of sprunkiness, but that's going to go to the base. It's going to change to the base logo. That does change. It's not a bad thing, but. I'm not sure it's, it works with the build that I'm currently dealing here. Roof. Stock roof. Spotlights. No, no, no. I don't want to do... I don't want to go that route for this one. Race suspension. Transmission. It's got to be all on the wheels. That's what's our, whether we go back and add all this stuff is whether or not I like the way the wheels look. Wheel type. High end. See what I mean? Like it's not it's not competitive as an off-roader. But maybe we could do something like this. Go with carbon and carbon. Not terribly sprunky, just a little sprunky. It's got a little bit of sprunk to it. Ooh, now that's I don't want to waste twenty-five thousand. What do you think there? That's a 50 50 90. It's good either way. I think those look more aggressive. Color, we can we can do some stuff with that. Can we get crew? <laughs> no, we can't get crew. That would be nice if you could do that. 
We could do white. We could give it a little bit more, um... Where did I just pass it off? Where'd it go? Come on, where's frost white? You can't get ice white for some reason. Nah, I think I think I like the alloy. Tire design. Nah, we're gonna we're gonna leave that go. Tire enhancements, bulletproof it. Tire smoke. Can't get the crew smoke. I don't rank. I'm probably not gonna. Um, you know, let's go back to respray. What are, what are we doing as far as primary color pearlescent? You can just throw a pearlescent on crew apparently. So. We can tone it down a little bit. Crank it up a little bit. Put ultra blue on this. Where's ultra blue? Make it weird. I think I think that's ruining the vibe though. Cream's interesting on the black. But not so much. I think we need to go with the white. Is that too... that too much? Maybe we just should just keep it with a carbon black just to keep the, bla the carbon bl black on us, you know? It doesn't really affect the, the green, but keeps the, keeps the black pure. Um, let's see. Roof, we aren't going to do anything with. Suspension's already slammed. Transmission's already done. I don't want to miss anything. Wheels, we did. Tires are, in fact, bulletproof. Can't get crew smoke. Windows, light smoke. Exit. Oh, yeah. And there you have it. I mean, it's, it's an interesting car. It looks cool. This has a, you know, a very matchbox, you know, Hot Wheels kind of flavor to it. As I recall, it really tends to not want to steer. It's got kind of slow steering. It's, it feels big and heavy. Heavier than it probably even would be here. With the big beefy suspension. But it does have a pretty good top speed, as I recall. I can't remember what it is, but it zips along. Okay. The one thing I... There you go. Just get a good way to turn around. One thing I will do, I think I'm going to put a Black Knight... Black Knight uh, plate on it with a black plate. Let's do that. And then, although it is not like an off road centric off roader, although it is still an off road, it's not one I'm going to. Uh, you would. Yeah. Let's fix fix the plate and let's see if it will go up Chiliad. Because that's what we do anymore. We run that little Chiliad hot lap kind of thing. This would be fun to drive to work, you know? It just would. Plate. Uh, yellow on black. Black Knight. And you know what? Let's now nah, if I if I change crew right now, it'll throw me out. Let's just do the. Uh, we'll do that. Yeah, let's see what happens. Hold on. Hey, jump. What happens to this car if I change crews? Social. My crews. Make base the active crew. Kick me. Don't know why it does that. Uh, as you can see, I've already, I've already desprunked my other character. There's a, there's another video coming. You have something to look forward to. But I was still because I want to do a little bit of sprunk crew lights on that one car. We're not changing, we're just selecting. And we're gonna 
we're gonna bring back Rusty's normal look. He's he's tired of walking around in a stocking. In my mind. But not before we we take a look at this. It should be my selected vehicle, so if I go when I leave the I leave the whatchamacallit, when I leave the casino, it should be parked outside. And it will be interesting to see what happens. Do the lights stay green? Or do the lights switch to blue? Does the paint color change? I think the paint stays. Boof, boof. All right, let's, let's de-sprunk ourselves here. Style, outfit, America. America. Summer's coming to an end, so we'll probably go with the Peach Biker look at some point soon. But yeah, this is this is kind of definitive for some of my cars. So maybe we'll just wear shirts all year round. It is L.A. after all. So, oh, we're in a public because we changed. Uh, there's a guy up on the roof probably just sniping people. Where is it? Well, if it's not here. leave GTA online bear with me here we're just gonna I'm gonna do this all in one shot here but there's no point in being around oppressor mark douches and stuff like that let's let's get a, a friendly happy place I like a friendly happy place where I can be happy friendly actually it's probably not really friendly I'm alone that's not friendly that's that's not a thing Here's someone calling me. Let's let's go AFK for just a second while this loads. Oh, life! You hear things, and it's like, okay, what's going on? All right, we're good. So, we're going to have to call up something here. Oh, yeah, we could do. We could go styling. Styling! Can I help you, sir? Okay, and do you have a preference for your aircraft? What if I didn't? Just give me something to fly in. Why not? Why not? I say, dare I say it, why not? How about the only pl oh, helicopter I have? That that be <laughs> only one that I can call in. Not even gonna pull in the gear. We're just gonna zip over here. Chopper commando our way in here. I gotta figure out a way to. to Play and record Chopper Command again. That'll be a little Activision fun. We walk in. We walk out. We don't have to worry about stocking up on Sprunk because it doesn't matter anymore. It just doesn't matter anymore. I tell you, it just doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter. I think I get that as a clip I throw into some of these. Little meatballs action going on. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Might lose some of those cars soon. If 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 the uh, if deliveries stay available, I won't need all three. I don't I need that many of these cars. I can just switch them up. Okay, so the the paint scheme stays the same. What about the lights? Can we even see them? Now it looks like the lights are staying green. Even though I am now in a different crew. Alright. Good, good then. This stays... 
All right, yes, we're doing something else now. So let us go to jobs, play job because we have to. It's an off-roader, even though I've not, I've, I've kind of upclassed it as opposed to off-roaded it. Chili on hot lap root. Does it retain its uh, its off-roader chops? From settings, play. This should make, you know, short work of Shiliad. My custom, sad to say, not the winning team brawler. I like the build on this, though. It's like, I think all the brawlers are usually just the crazy... Lots of lights, lots of bumpers. I don't even have a roll bar. This is just clean. It's and I, I that wasn't the way to do that, but it, 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 it handled it well enough. We've already scar scratched it up a little bit. All right, still bouncing over rocks. Off road traction loss should be good. Should be. So we should zip right along here on the dirt. It's not going to ride the rails that well, but it really shouldn't need to as long as they don't launch it into the ocean here, you know? Yeah, it likes going over things, so that's good. Time for the G Fred Hot Lap Proof. Zoom. And yes, you know, I really should trim out like that little that little pause for like 30 seconds where I had to hop away from the thing. But I'm really trying to get this done without any editing. Is that lazy? What the heck is this? The off-roader struggles? All right, let's go. And no, I'm not trying to be lazy with that. It's just that I have a lot of videos to edit at this point. There's just a bunch of work to do. And I want to get this out. I want, you know, sometimes you got to think about getting the video out. And who will be patient with you? And I think my fan base here is patient with me. I think we're good. Well, it recovered okay. But that wasn't nearly as good as what I thought it was going to be. And look at that. It looks like it's two-wheel drive, which I did not expect that. Does this have a front diff? Doesn't look like it. Okay, well... I mean, the power should be there. It was, it, it, it was known for having a good top, top end. Okay, so short work it might not make. It's doing okay now. We got here. You say, oh, well, you have the problem is you didn't put, like, the bull bars on and everything like that. You didn't leave the, t the suspension really high and all that kind of stuff. Otherwise, it would have had no trouble. No, nope, that's not how this works. Try and go down. Can I finally figure out the right place to turn right? You know, you think for all the G-Freds I've found, I think... It's like it's right there, and well, I was turning, I was breaking and turning, and it just wouldn't make the turn. It doesn't like to turn. And here's your punishment: didn't want to turn. Now you are punished. You got to turn before you think you need to with this one. All right, but we got here. We've worked our way to an okay place. Yeet! 
You gotta be kidding. That's this is Okay, I'm recording this video after another one, so this this is going up first because this is the car I bought first and that's how I organized my mind. And I went off the wrong edge. I went off the back end of the We're gonna reset. And we're just gonna this is not how you do this. Didn't blow up there. Okay. Wow. So just, just well, yeah, I won't give away too much. We'll, we'll talk. We'll talk later. We'll talk later about this because I want this video up first before I send the other video up. See how complicated things are now. We do have a second chance. Brakes. Brakes are not great. I think the, the the turning point right after this fence. Let's be, and then you follow down this way. And you follow this line past those trees. Oh, I hit a rock. See, you're supposed to go to, more to the left there, but I hit a rock, and then it, it didn't go well. I'm supposed to go up and then down this way. I think. I'm learning. We'll eventually learn. I'll grow up. I'll learn the way. I'll learn so that my later days will be prosperous. Um, let's see. Chocolate covered. If it don't bite off more than I can hide. Do 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 do. Talking candy bar blues, anyone? All right. Let's just. All right. So that that didn't go well. Ah, it's a train. Will we will we fit? Well, if we if we completely violate physics, we can. Which apparently you, you can. This physics. <laughs> Who needs physics? Physics. <laughs> well, there are physics in this game. It's just that they're not our physics. They're not the physics of our world. They're physics of this world because... You can create whatever physics you want in video games, and that's that's a lovely thing. If you're playing a video game, you want fantasy, not reality, probably. So, wow, a little sensitive to that bump, that little rock there, a little bit of a boing. Turning before we thought we needed to. All right. Are you kidding me? Alright, let's go. Now, I think I need to turn a little bit later than I have been on, on these videos, so let's... Gotta get up to that observatory to finish off the, tr the, the race. I think we're gonna go here, and then turn up. Then take this ridge up this way. Yeah, I think that was a lot smoother. And whatever it was I've whatever I've been doing. Now let's see if we can not slide all over the place and make this jump up here. Uh, this is the the see that's how you do that. And that's the proper way to make that transition. So, can't say, oh dear, yeah. Can't say that this is an optimal G Fred car, obviously. It's, it's not bad, but you can blow yourself up on it. And that's and this is with armor. I did put armor on, right? Well, not critical. It's not going to be, it's not going to get raced that often. It's mostly going to be a garage decoration, I must admit. At that, I think it excels. Oh. <sighs> and while we're at it, because I don't know if this deserves its own video, let's do one more thing. One more desprunkification. 
if you would bear with me. With bear with me while I fix up my deluxo. <clears throat> so we teleport this puppy back. And vehicles. Bois. Call my mechanique. Which, first things first, let's see how the, the car looks now. You need something, huh? One of your rides? Let me know. I do, and that should be in nightclub service center. I'll bring it by. And they're supposed to bring it by pretty quick anymore, so let's see. Poop. Okay, so the logo has changed. The lights have not. I'm blowing it back. Let's see. Yeah, it's still got the green sprunk lights. We're gonna, we're gonna lose that, and the the uh, the tires. Um, let's see. I think we can do everything here. In we need this right here. Pick that out of the mess of icons. Should I turn off the lights all together on the bottom? I mean, that will that will affect the handling, but how often am I... It, it does throw off some lights whenever it's uh, flying anyway. But that white... We just make them white. Just make it a brighter white. If we're going to play with the physics, and have it maybe lower the center of gravity a little bit. Yeah, we need the magic touch. We want to make this the 50s Back to the Future version. So we go down. Lights, first of all. Neon kits. Neon color white. There you go. Why is it not changing? Change it to blue and then to white. There you go. Something was weird there. And then we go to respray. Dump the chrome emblems. Okay. Somehow that that didn't feel. I felt weird, but it worked. Um. Let's see. Wheels. Wheel color. Get this back to a. You know, we could make it orange. That would kind of fit with them. It's almost back to the future. Sunrise orange. Now we're going to go with. Candy red is probably the correct color. Although, you know, maybe like a, a blaze red might be better. I think it was a blaze red. Which is more back to the future versus which is more... Let's go, Candy. And that was just something that I wanted to do. We've desprunked it. Now, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.